Hey guys, welcome back. So, some of you may or may not know, I'll be starting a new position at my work. Joining the Union Machine Shop. And a big part of what they do there is when they have anywhere in the building where we have a equipment breakdown, a piece of machinery breaks down, they call the machinist to come and fix it, belts, pulleys, bearings, such and such. So you can't bring your whole toolbox with you. So what all these guys like to have is their everyday carry bag, which is your essentials. And then you'll grab whatever specific thing you're gonna need for the job that you got the call for. And there'll be some basic stuff that you'll carry no matter what. You know, your lights and pliers. But anyway, you know me and my tools, man. I did pick up some new stuff. I did have an old tool bag, but it was shot. It was completely destroyed. I left it in the back of my truck for like two years in the snow and everything. So I was going to go through and maybe have a look sees. Kind of just getting up. Like in my PJs having coffee. Right off the bat. Just loving this husky bag. This bag I'm just loving. Picked up some Milwaukee screwdrivers. I've got some more. I love these things. I love Milwaukee stuff. Uh, so yeah, the everyday carry. Got my work light. Let's see if we're in frame. I'm going to check sure you guys can even see what's going on here. I don't know. I'm not so sure. Kind of, sort of. The old work light. Must have. They provide us with the work light also. But I like the little one. The one they provide us is kind of big. These will be... Uh, my pocket everyday carry and my other Milwaukee slip joint pliers. I love Milwaukee's and they're real good steel. I mean, there's like no flex in these handles. Nice and tight. Uh, they weren't super expensive either. The Milwaukee vice grips. Huge fan. These things are just super tight. I really like these. I don't know who makes them for Milwaukee, but Absolutely love these. Yep, some vice grips. I did get these. I've always wanted these, and I finally grabbed them. DeWalt compound pliers. So, I guess you can actually cut a penny in half with these. I don't want to try it, but I guess there's so much high leverage with these, you could actually cut a penny in half with these. So, ultra high leverage pliers. Uh... Milwaukee needle nose, real stiff, rigid, good needle nose. Uh, ratchet. This is my um, the ratchet in my my sockets. That's not the best, so I do have a good high end ratchet, snap on ratchet, adjustable wrench. What else? Allen's. We use the crap out of tons of Allen's there. I do have Allen sets, but they weren't complete. I always end up losing one of the little ones, so I had to pick up a complete set. I always go with the ball end. That's important. You always want the ball end. I think it was like 12 bucks. So we'll see. Time will tell if they're any good or not. I really, I don't know. I've never owned Husky stuff. You know, I don't know. I'm in a pickle. I don't know if I should be bringing my good snap-on stuff to work or if I should leave the snap-on stuff home for working on things. But for the time being... Good snap-on screwdriver sets coming with, at least till I get something else. I really don't want to have to buy two sets of snap-on things. One for home, one for work, you know. Uh, every time I go in the machine shop, I end up with a sliver. Every time. I'm not even joking. The last time I was in there, I had three slivers. So I picked up a really good high-end tweezer set. I'm sure that'll come in handy for a few things. Uh, the old hammer, got to have a hammer. My work gloves. Uh, 
big old channel locks. The big boys, the big bastards. Those come in handy for a lot of stuff. I have all my punches, I guess. There are a lot of roll pins and a lot of situations where we use punches, so I do carry my whole set. That's something we'll be using quite a bit. It's a good set of punches. I mean, it's there's there's roll pins and everything there. You're always having to knock knock them out. Uh, this you don't bring with on your calls. I just brought it home. I have some Milwaukee precision screwdrivers. I got some more. I do have my good Klein wrenches in here. Just SAE standard. I don't have metric. My metric snap-on ones are actually there in the toolbox. Um, Klein makes really good stuff. These are really good heavy-duty wrenches. This bag, it just has so many pockets. So many pockets. My snap-on screwdriver stubbies. Got a swivel head ratchet, some pocket screwdrivers. My whole set of blue point pliers. I probably don't really need these in there. I don't know. But yeah, I got the whole set of blue point pliers. This bag is awesome. There's just so many pockets. But yeah, this is going to be my everyday carry. I think I got everything. I think I about covered it all. Pretty excited. Really looking forward to it. It's right up my alley. Machinery repair and stuff's just perfect for me, I think. Pretty excited. But anyway, thank you for watching. Have yourself a great day. And we'll see you soon. Bye-bye.